So this is my 2015 M3. I'm just gonna go over the car just to show you any uh, imperfections and anything like that. So the car did have a, a wrap on it before. So there is, um, like for example, right, let's see right about there. There's just a, like a little bit of adhesion that will come off. I don't know if you can see that in the, uh, is it just, the more you rub on it, the more it comes off there. But I just, just a few things that I wanted to note. There's a little piece of adhesion over here as well. Uh, and then just some on the side. There's just some over there. Hopefully the video's coming out okay. The taillights and the headlights have a little bit of a tint to it. Um, you can't really notice it, but when the vehicle is side by side with a different one, you can tell. Um, the diffuser was wrapped like in a carbon fiber uh, wrap, but it is coming apart as you can see right there. So um, that would probably be better just to maybe replace it or replace it with a, an actual carbon fiber piece. This is also carbon fiber as well, the lip. Overall, there's really, there's really nothing. I'll show you the, the ding that I mentioned before. And it's right, right there. And that happened when the wrap was on and then it was just a rock nick, uh, rock that nicked it and um, it went through the um, went through the film. The headlights also have a little bit of a, a little bit of a, um, a tint to them as well. You can see the difference there. So there was um, let's see if you can see it right there. So right here, that is scratched down to the bumper itself. That was from, uh, this uh, was a little bit loose and, um, and vibrated and um, kind of wore out the, the paint there. Same thing on the other side, just at the bottom there. So these, I ended up putting uh, the double-sided 3M um, right around here. Same thing on the other side. So there are also, and I, I'm not sure why, but I noticed on the grill, this grill, has some rock chips. But the passenger side didn't get anything. And these are the original ones. Um, so I'm not sure, you know, I'm not sure why. But uh, just definitely something worth noting. Uh, and here you can see a little bit of, from when the wrap was removed, right there. And again, I'll definitely try to um, take some of, you know, take as much of it off as I can. Other than that, there's no other dings. Windshield is original windshield. There is uh, no rock chips or cracks or anything in the windshield. The interior is pretty good. There's no like abnormal wear or anything like that. seats and everything like you can see because I had um, two uh, just the booster seats sitting back here but there's no um, low, no indentations in the leather I took them off just right after I uh, went for the car wash actually you can kind of see where it was sitting right here but uh, this one here was just removed um, I don't know maybe half an hour ago oh, and this side here was removed uh, a few days ago so I'm pretty sure that that will just um, even out as well. Again, hopefully the quality of the video is coming out okay and it's not blurry or anything. The back windows and the side windows are tinted. Um, I did have tint on the front windows, um, but then I just I removed it.
that's just this is the car seat that I removed and then that's the one that was uh, I believe that was on the passenger side So the windshield also has, um, it actually has a layer of, uh, like a, um, it's like 3M, but it's uh, Expel is the brand, and it's on the windshield. Um, so to help with any um, rock chips or anything like that. And again, and the steering wheel um, has like no, you know, I'm always like very picky, cautious, I guess, with how I, um, you know, run my hands on the steering wheel. And there's no, let's see if I can capture anything. There we go. And there's no, like, no wear. I would say, you know, like it, it does not look like there's any anything unusual. Nothing that would show the mileage of the vehicle. And the uh, windshield has, like I said, it has a layer on the outside. Uh, and then it just has like a very, very light, um, not even noticeable actually. Uh, it's fairly clear um, protection on the inside as well, like a film on the inside. side the wheels there's no curb rash or anything on the wheels as well engine stock except just the air filters that I was telling you about I did notice on one of the wheels, so the, the tires are still the, uh, the PSS tires, one of the wheels has, let's see if I can find it, has a little nick right here. And the only reason and it happened when I had the tires mounted and dismounted, the, the wheels were perfect until, until that. Um, and you can only, like you can't even see it. Let's see if I can focus so there. You can't even see it unless you just go right up to uh, right there unless you go right up to the side there but otherwise like looking like this you can't even tell at all so that's about it I guess I can try to do um, a little bit of a drive with the vehicle So everything, all this, like all the um, settings and stuff work. Uh, Bluetooth, all that stuff, I've got no issues with. Um, satellite radio, I've never, um, never activated it. But you can, you know, like there's no issues with the um, um, iDrive or anything like that. Sunroof opens and closes fine. Um, the car still has warranty and everything up until 200,000 kilometers, so it's got another 115,000 kilometers in warranty. So I will try, it might be a little bit tough, but I will try to drive it uh, showing... Heads up display and everything works perfectly fine.
guess if you have any questions, just let me know. Um, and if I think of anything else that's uh, worth mentioning, then I will definitely let you know. But uh, aside from that one nick on the hood, um, and those two little scratches from the carbon fiber, um, whatever you call those little pieces in the front bumper, uh, it's actually in, in pretty awesome condition. Um, a little bit of that adhesive from the, because the whole car had a matte expel wrap. Um, but yeah, aside from that, everything, everything was perfect. So let me know if you have questions. Thanks.